In our previous video, we talked about half-wave rectifier, full-wave rectifier, and filter circuits. In half-wave rectifier, we noted that we can use one diode. It conducts with forward current and blocks when the reverse current flows. In full-wave rectifiers, we can use two diodes with the help of center tap transformer to achieve full-wave rectification, which is biphase circuit rectifier. Or we can use four diodes to form a full-wave rectification without the center tap transformer. Replying on the comment of my previous video, let's see full wave bridge rectifier. Let's break it down. We know that AC current always alternate in direction. For more details, check previous video. We can note the forward current will yellow and reverse current with blue. The four diodes can be connected in such a way that each two diode form a forward bias. First, let's connect the conductor in a bridge manner, such that it forms a rhombus with four end joints. Applying the AC to the joint through this terminal and this one. According to Kirchhoff's laws, precisely Kirchhoff's current law, the current will divide at the bridge. The other end will still receive alternating current. We can decide to block the current of the two sides each half cycle through the help of a diode. When forward current in yellow, the first two diodes are conducting as shown. When the reverse current is applied to the same circuit, remember current changes the direction, hence the diodes are reversed biased and doesn't allow current flow. Similarly, when reverse current is applied to the other two diodes, the diodes become forward biased since the reverse current will form their forward current and they conduct. Also, when the current changes direction, the diodes will block it. Hence, when we combine these diodes in the bridge circuit, it forms a full wave rectifier as shown. The voltage regulator and capacitors are used for filtering the waveform to form pure DC voltage. For more, check our previous videos. Thank you for reaching out. Thank you for the subscriptions, likes, shares, and comments. Also, thanks to those who liked and followed our Facebook page at Wired Wisdom Engineering. I hope you found this video informative. If you did, kindly subscribe, like, and share. Like our Facebook page link in the first comment. See you in the next one.